Hi boys and girls, my name's Ivan James and I'm a cellist in the Tasmanian Symphony Orchestra. So let me just inform you about what all the parts of the instrument are called. First of all, we have the scroll at the top, have pegs, strings, nut, fingerboard, bridge, tailpiece, the saddle, end pin or spike. We have sound holes and inside we have a post, a sound post and a bass bar which runs from about here to here underneath. We have the belly, the ribs and the back and of course the neck. Now I'll talk about how the sound is produced. The strings have to vibrate to make any sound at all. So we can pluck them, obviously, like that with our fingers. That's called pizzicato in Italian. Or we can use our bow to make the string vibrate side to side. Which makes for a longer sustained sound. And what happens is the string vibrations are transmitted through the bridge to the belly, through the feet of the bridge that are attached to the belly. On one side, the treble side, that's the high side, is a sound post which runs from the belly to the back and transmits the vibrations to the back and helps produce the treble sounds. On the bass side of the instrument, that's the low side, there's the bass foot of the bridge which is directly above a bar of wood which runs from about here to here inside the instrument and that helps not only to support the belly from and stop it collapsing under the pressure of the strings, but transmits vibrations across the belly from the bass side of the instrument. So that's basically how the cello works. So I hope you enjoy listening to the TSO.